Okay, so this video will be my final video in the theory of computation video series. This, this video will talk about um, really theories of everything. The final, which is appropriate for the final video because the theory of everything is, you know, it's lots of TOEs have been proposed. Um, the most recent one being Chris Langan's CTMU, Cognitive Theoretic Model of the Universe, which really uh, argues that uh, the human mind, um, well, I should say the universe, is a really a combination of reality and your perception of that reality and uh, uh, that kind of makes sense because you know one person's view is opinion is different from another person's opinion because of their perception of it but the reality they're perceiving is, a, is about the same thing so and there, there are many other theory of everything proposed you know by William Sidis uh, you know uh, um, entropy reversals and then you know um, lots of other TOEs proposed and with computer science I would imagine this, this is just you know definitely something that will be you know study as human you know as uh as we near closer to understanding you know all the laws of physics and you're utilizing those laws to make you know efficient inventions and using computer science to invent things like artificial agents things like that so but the toe's are definitely one aspect of you know what what is to come now what about also um what was this mean for people if all these computers are super fast will they really need humanity around now that is obviously a problem for ethical AI and that will be discussed. I would imagine that will be discussed much more as artificial intelligence becomes more likely or probability because right now it's debatable as to whether it can be actually be done or not. I mean, maybe if it can be done, I would imagine there would obviously be steps, steps to show that okay, maybe now we can say that if we you know fix this problem, make this tweak here, we can actually make an artificial agent. And you know what exactly does this all mean? You know that's it's weird way to see for the future holds. Nothing in the future is ever certain. Um, that's just fact of life, you know, that's just what happens. But, um, so yeah, that is one thing to really think about, you know, the year of everything is, you know, under complete understanding of, you know, the reality around us and how we, you know, relate from one person to the next person. Uh, just as, you know, Chris Lincoln argues, I mean, I completely agree with him. I read the, I read a good chunk of the CTMU, and, um, it, it really does make a lot of sense. I mean, he really, uh, bridges the gap between philosophy and, you know, science and mathematics and how, you know how exactly do we relate relate the two, and uh, what 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 all you know what ultimate reality can we you know uh, extrapolate and you know draw out from this correlation, and uh, so yeah that is the um, final video on the theory of computation video series. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll be taking a break from videos from my videos for about a week I think, and uh, then I will I guess maybe start my quantum physics video series. I'm gonna upload a few more videos of Tekken Six. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying the channel. Remember, it's going to be diverse. I'm going to put some drawing and painting videos up. And, uh, you know, just more cool stuff is supposed to be on the way. So uh, that that's all for now. Uh, see you guys uh, later.